One of the interesting things about Moya Moya is that it was a condition that was rarely diagnosed and unheard of really 30 years ago. When, when I lecture about Moya Moya, one of the patients I show is a patient that I saw when I was a resident first who was uh, four years old and she had had a stroke and uh, she had had an arteriogram done and the blood vessel blockage was seen but we didn't recognize what the condition was and we didn't know that we could treat it and as luck would have it years later I saw her again she had had two more strokes in the intervening 10 years and I ended up operating on her literally years after I had first seen her as a resident so uh, I think in children, first of all, nobody thinks of stroke. And when kids do have stroke or paralysis, people think of it as something else. They can't conceive that the kids would actually have a stroke. So it is underdiagnosed and uh, hard to pick up. In certain of our patient populations, like for example, some of the children with Down syndrome or some of the children who are developmentally delayed, the children don't often say anything to their caregivers about symptoms they're having. An adult would say, I've had a, an episode where my arm went limp or I lost the sensation in a leg, but the kids tend not to say anything about it and unless the parents see something, the diagnosis can be delayed for a considerable period of time.